A lot of the people who've come through the gate tonight have come to see this man in action. On your marks. Men's 800 at the 2011 Track Classic in Melbourne. And away they go and look at those loping strides of David Rudisha straight away out of the blocks and he's going to make sure that he's up near the front when they cross going down the back straight and also making some early ground is Tyler Mulder and he's going very quickly and it's going to be Mulder who's going to lead from Chip Kierwok who goes up and past him now and here's Rudisha just getting the big strides in through the middle of the field and the man who's going to head him is going to be Sammy Tangui. So it's Tangui leading from Rudisha and they've gone pretty hard in the early stages of this. They're making some time. Chip Kierwok is third. In fourth place is Mulder as they enter the straight now. And the pace has been very, very solid early. It has. Semi Tangua is David's choice pacemaker. And David actually came up to him and said, would you spend 12 months of being my pacemaker? So he has actually helped him get two world records. So with one lap to go, they go through in 51.23. And now Tangui pulls off and Rhodesia is just going to put the foot down. Chip Kierwok is in second placing. That piece of elastic might be about to break as they go down the back straight, though. Mulder's up into third in fourth place is Renshaw. And Simmons is behind him in fifth but Radisha is in a class of his own at the 200 he clears away by about six seven meters it's an increasing gap now from the world record holder running strongly up into second placing is Nick Simmons who's coming home very well he looks as though he might have second sewn up Chip Kierwok starting to weaken and Mulder's got up into third placing but here's the style of the fastest man in the world over 800 meters David Radisha the time is going to be all important here he's about eight meters out in front of Nick Simmons in second placing and Rudisha is going to win. Simmons will get second and getting home into third Lachlan Renshaw in the time of 1.43.90 as expected David Rudisha in a class of his own. He did, he came home so strong over that, that last 50 metres. I'm sure he'll be really interested to see what time he's done. David Rudisha has done a, one, a 1.43.88 which is unofficial so Lachlan might have come out with the season's best there.